A burning platform issue is present when something threatens your business to the degree that staying put may pose the greater threat rather than change. It was Friar Jump, so I jumped. That's a quote from Andy Moken. Back in 1988, he was actually on an oil rig that had caught on fire. It was about 9.30 in the evening and an explosion erupted on the Piper Alpha oil drilling platform. This was just located in the North Sea right off the coast of Scotland. When Andy heard the explosion, he left his cot and started making his way through the smoke and heat to the edge of the oil platform. Now this was several stories above the surface of the ocean and he couldn't see the surface of the ocean even looking over the edge of the platform. Now with smoke arising when and if he decided to jump he didn't know if he'd be jumping into oil burning on the surface of the ocean and he could only survive actually a few a, a few minutes before he succumbed to hypothermia if not rescued after getting into the ocean. But when rescuers did come by in a boat and pick him up after he had jumped, they asked him how did he build up the courage to actually jump and leap in that type of a situation. And that was his answer. I knew it was fry or jump. He knew that if he stayed, he was most likely going to die. So he took his chance and he jumped. In our businesses, everything we do is temporary. Again, change is happening all the time. It is the only thing that is consistent. To change with change is the changeless state, uh, as Bruce Lee once pointed out. So what is it that possibly threatens your business? Again, everything is on a maturity curve. If you look at the Sony Walkman that came out in 1979, um, what, 10, 15 years was pretty much the life for the cassette player with it. Then it transitioned to a CD player then it transitioned to digital music. So it changed with time and took advantage of technology and you could still buy a Sony there's Walkman opportunity. today. Possi there's possible opportunity in change. Even in our personal lives, burning platform issues can drive positive change. A routine visit to the doctor that uncovers high blood pressure, that uh, we're a potential risk for heart attack, you know, I'd rather find out then than find out from a massive heart attack. That uh, information might be the very motivation that I need to start eating more healthy and exercising. There is something that is called a pressure cooker. And the pressure cooker is, you know, we, we might be in a state that we know is, is wrong, you know, say financially or physically or problems with a business. But you know what? It's not bad enough to drive change. There's always a resistance to change. We need some motivation to push us through that resistance. Just like an airplane needs more throttle to get off the runway than to maintain level flight, if we're going to drive change, we got to break through that resistance. And a burning platform issue, once identified and shared, can be the very thing to cause that. So again, with your own business, are there things right now, technologies, things happening in the market, that threaten the very existence of your business? If so, this can be the very thing you need to create that sense of urgency and motivation to break through those barriers and drive positive change. We need to create that sense of urgency. We recognize our current condition, then what we want to achieve with the business, that next step, and we create that dynamic tension. We're in control of it. And that's what we need to identify those burning platform issues to be able to do, to help motivate us to drive change. So we're going to leverage them. We're going to identify them and we're going to create a shared vision for getting out of those and moving forward.